My cat scratched me this morning. Oh, but I still love him now. Mew, 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 mew. Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Thank you so much for being here. It means so much to me that you're here. So, as you can see, this is another PR unboxing video. Look at all those parcels, girl. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Box of box and box, bags and bags and bags. <sighs> my cat looks so scared right now. So before I start this video, I have a few things to talk about and if you want to skip, by all means, go for it, I don't mind. But if you want to stay tuned in what I have to say, please stay. <laughs> so the first thing I want to say is thank you to everyone who watched my first PR unboxing video. I was very shocked at how many views that video got. I mean, to some people it's not a lot of views, but to me it's a lot because I am a very small channel and it just means a lot to me when someone takes the time to watch my video and actually engage and see my reaction to the parcel so thank you to everyone who took the time to watch it and gave that video a like as well and I also want to say a really 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 big thank you to everyone who watched my Dermapen video the first one that video got a million views what the hell oh my god that is crazy I didn't think that video would get a million views it's just insane like Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> I want to say thank you to everyone who supported my decision in getting the Dermapen done. I know not everybody wants to get the Dermapen done, but if you have really, really large pores and a lot of acne scars and very textured skin, then the Dermapen can help out so much because it helps smooth out the skin and it helps minimize the pores as well. My next video, well, not the next video after this, but I will film a video update of my third Dermapen session and let you guys know what it actually is and how it actually works because I still get questions like does it hurt, does it really work, like yes it does work and you do see differences within the first video to the second video but anyway I am more of an Instagrammer than a YouTuber but I am making so much more effort with my YouTube this year because I really want to connect with you guys. I feel like with Instagram you know you can't really get to know me through my makeup tutorials but through my YouTube I feel like you can get to know me because I'm speaking to you guys so I just want to say thank you to everyone who supported me from the beginning because of you guys. I was able to travel to Bora Bora with Tarte Cosmetics and I was also able to travel to LA as well for Glam Glow. So thank you to everyone who has been there for me and rooted for me and believed in me and accepted me for who I am. It's so hard to be the authentic real you on the internet. I feel like a lot of people shy away or they put up this persona which is nothing wrong with that. I just feel like you know I didn't want to do that for my channel. I just wanted it to just be me and be about you guys and just talk about makeup and have fun with it and just let you guys know that you don't need to be a hundred and ten percent perfect on camera you can just be silly you can do stupid stuff and you can you know act a certain way <laughs> and people out there will accept you for you so thank you so much to everyone who supported me from the beginning and yeah I can't believe I can call this a career yeah Ooh. all right let's start opening these i am ready i got my scissors yodrian water the first thing i'm gonna open is this okay this is from like exi or ex1 i don't know how to say it i think it's exi cosmetics and look they're so extra look at this right they stuck oprah on the box and you got to film this if you're gonna open it so that is what i'm doing i say this up i know this has been in my house for about over a month now and i haven't opened it because i wanted to wait until i have everything ready yeah! I have seen EXI everywhere in London, like in the tube stations. I think in America you guys call it Subway, or well, in England we call it the tube station. And they had posters everywhere, like everywhere, saying that it's one of the best foundations ever. So I'm like, we will see. Okay, so it's available in Boots and it's been around for a few months now. It was available on 17th of January, so it's definitely in store in Boots and. Oh. Oh my god, oh my god, okay, let me bring the camera. Massive, look at that. Ta -da! I am loving this, this is so extra, oh my god. Ah! Oh my god, I get yo-yo. Oh, oh. 
<laughs> so these are the EXI foundations and do you know what for a drugstore brand this packaging is looking a little bougie I like it I like how it's like bronze yeah it's really nice and expensive I believe it's $12.99 that's what I can remember from the um the posters that I saw in the tube station and I'm just gonna do some quick swatches and also I read behind the um the bowl it says that it's skin like pigment which I like the sound of and it's perfect coverage that is almost invisible okay when brands say that this is like perfect and everything I'm just like Anyway, it's oil and fragrance free and it's non-pore clogging, which is something I struggle on a daily basis. I hate getting clogged pores. Like today, I'm not wearing any foundation. And the reason why is because I am not risking getting any more clogged pores. It took me a year to get rid of them. And finally, I am, um, wow, that blue tongue. Finally, I'm able to just be confident and just not having to wear foundation all the time for the camera when I go out. So those are the swatches. I think I'm in the middle one, but I might need to mix them middle one and the bottom one just to see if I can get the exact shade. There is a slight fragrance even though it says it's fragrance free but I can't describe the smell. I think that's just the smell of foundation in general. I don't know. Oh, it's from Ilora again. Darling, how are you, lovely? I just wanted to top you up with some Ilora goodies. Lots of love, Narissa. Thank you so much, Narissa. This is from Ilora again. I absolutely love Ilora. I'm going to put this in my giveaway because I love Ilora eyelashes and I want you guys to try it out as well. They're available in Boots and Superdrugs in the UK, but I don't know where they are available in the US. I believe it's Ulta. I think so. I think it's like, you know, like the convenience, um, store like CVS and all of that. I don't know. I'm from the UK, okay? So don't judge me. Sharon is Karen, so I'm gonna put this in the giveaway. Laura Mercier, okay, I'm really excited to know what is in here because Laura Mercier never sends me stuff until now. <laughs> Flawless Fusion Ultra Longwear Concealers. Okay, so these are concealers. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, so these are the concealers. Okay, so what is so special about these concealers? True to Laura's Flawless Face Philosophy. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not going to read all of that because that's really long. Uh, da, 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 da. So it's 12 hours of crease resistant wear. It's medium to full coverage with a natural luminous finish. That I can believe because of the translucent powder. So I'm hoping that when they mean that it's natural luminous finish, I can just think of the Laura Mercier translucent powder. So I'm hoping it gives like the same finish. It's weightless, fills with blurring effects, coverage that might increase, 12 hours wear, transfer, sweat, humidity, and water resistant. I love in the sound of that. Lara. All your fragrance, paraben, and sulfate free and dermatologist tested. Cool. Okay, let's do some swatches, guys. So this is what it looks like. That is the packaging. Very simple, very professional looking because Laura Mercier is a professional makeup brand. So this is in the shade 6W. And this is in the shade 2C. So I presume C stands for cool and W stands for warm. And this is in the shade 2W. So as you can see, 2C is a little bit more pink. So when it means cool, I think they mean it's more like peachy and type of undertone. And then W is more like yellow, more warmer. Let me look for um, another concealer that's like in the middle, you know? Oh, they also have four N. So I presume N stands for neutral, which means there is no particular undertone. I know a lot of darker skin tones, they're more neutral rather than red or yellow. Bearing in mind, yeah, it's not my concealer color, but I thought I'd just show you guys. So on my skin tone, that's how it looks for N. So you can see it's not too warm or not too pink or not too cool toned. And then this one is 3W. So this might be my shade. Oh, probably not. This might be like a go-to concealer shade where I don't wear any foundation, but I don't want to brighten up my under eyes. So that might be something I could wear on a daily basis when I'm not wearing any foundation. Cool, I'm excited to try these out. Thank you so much to Laura Mercier. Oh, I'm excited. I'm gonna try these out and then I'm gonna put the Laura Mercier translucent powder on top. Oh my God, that could look so bomb if these concealers are good. I'm gonna do one side here and then one side over here just to like switch it up. All right, all right, all right. No! This is pretty. Oh my God. Are you ready guys? Oh, oh my god. It's time to nude with attitudes. Hashtag unnudes. Oh. All right, all right. Let me just take you off. 
Oh, wait, hold on, I'm confused. Do I open? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I open. I open. Oh, I, I slide. I, it's a slide. Okay. I slide this down and you see all of it. This is so beautiful. Oh my god. Come now. This is all the news. This is so beautiful. Oh my god. This purple one, I need to swatch. Okay. And then I'm going to swatch this one as well called Seductress. Oh. Oh, look at that pigment. Did you see that? That was beautiful. All right, next one. Yes. Okay, come through Maybelline. Maybelline is actually one of my favorite drugstore brands because a lot of this stuff is like high quality for like a cheaper price, which I like. And their lipsticks and liquid lips and all of their lip products is something that I really enjoy wearing as well as their foundations and concealers. Honestly obsessed with a lot of Maybelline products. So I cannot wait to try this out. Thank you so much for sending me these. Okay, Buxoms, what have you got for me, girl? Oh, I have a massive card in here. Oh my god. Oh, congratulations. Very well done. A huge congratulations to the most awesome girl. You deserve lots of love from the Buxom team. Oh my god, thank you so much. This is so cute. I think this is when I hit 1 million <gasps> followers on Instagram, which is totally insane, by the way. Thank you so much for following me on Instagram. And yeah, thank you so much, Buxoms. I love Buxoms. I love the team. Oh my god, they're so funny and every time I see them we always have a good laugh as well and I genuinely enjoy using the products as well and they sent me these oh, oh this is so cute my flamingo broke though but yeah looky 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 look at that ah! This is so cute. Thank you so much, Buxons. I'm gonna make a tea after I finish unboxing everything and I'm gonna enjoy these as well. This one, okay, I collected this parcel before I flew out and I was like, I really, really, really wanna open this but I can't open it. I had to wait until I came back. So finally, I can open it. First of all, look at these. Look at these American stickers, it's so cute. And look, it's even got this string around it. I love little things like that. I honestly feel like when a person or a company or anyone who owns a business and they make effort with like packagings and labels and everything it just goes to show how much they appreciate the little details i'm one of those people where i appreciate the little details and things so i'm very interested in who this is from oh from l'oreal what what wait l'oreal from america i'm so confused because i work with the l'oreal uk team uh, i didn't know the l'oreal us team knows about me Oh my god! Oh my god! L'Oreal Paris and Fable Pro Glow has landed from the US! That's why! Hi! <laughs> so cool! So this is the Pro Glow Foundation. Look, they even have a foam finger. Woo! I got more food! Oh my god! I have friends coming over for Easter weekend, so this is something we're gonna be munching on. They even got me little pretzels as well and they got me oh, I love Mountain Dew I haven't had Mountain Dew for a really long time because it is really high in sugar but just for you L'Oreal I will drink this do you know what enough of the food let's go to the makeup now <laughs> so this is the 24 hour foundation Infallible Pro Glow I'm gonna test this out I'm gonna go the extra mile I'm gonna test this out I'm gonna try wear it for 24 hours wish me luck guys I just had an idea in my head full face of new products coming soon oh I've got two Mountain Dew drinks thank Thank you. Oh, Reese's! <gasps> I love Reese's! <coughs> I just got too excited. Wait, how much do I have on this Five Guys card though? I really want to know. I could take my boyfriend there on a date. <laughs> Oh my god. This is making me so happy because it's free makeup and free food. Oh yeah, it's also available on Amazon from March 10th as well. The Pro Glow Foundations in case you're interested in trying them out. <sighs> All right, Too Faced. Too Faced again. I love Too Faced. I didn't think Too Faced was going to be one of those brands that I enjoy wearing their makeup. I genuinely do like their makeup now, especially products that they've been sending me. I mean, some of the eyeshadow palettes don't make sense to me, but the quality of it is amazing. I'm not going to lie. It's pretty dope. <gasps> <laughs> so this is the Too Faced White Peach Shimmer Glitter Matte. I don't know what that means, but it sounds adorable. <gasps> okay, she's kind of messy, but it's okay. Let me just fix her up quickly. Ta-da! 
So this is eyeshadows. Okay, like I said, before I opened it, some of the eyeshadows don't make sense to me, but let's just pray the color coordination in this is on point. Yeah, that is a good color coordination. Thank you, Too Faced. This is cute. I'm loving this. This one, though. Look at that. Let me swatch this. Oh, my God. Zoom you in. Wow, that's beautiful. Okay, next one. That's cute. I like that. I'm really excited. These are my colors. Do you know what, guys? I have been trying to step out of my comfort zone and not do like the same makeup look where I use peach and browns and pink, even though I've got that on me right now. I'm trying to step out of my comfort zone and play with more vibrant colors. So if you have any like makeup ideas, please send them to me because I need to up my makeup game and yeah, <laughs> help me out, please. This is cute. I can't wait. I'm loving these dark colors at the bottom actually i like how they added like a little bit of ooh mystery type of things in there let me swatch you oh that feels so creamy you know when you swatch an eyeshadow and it just hits the spot i don't think that made any sense but anyway oh this is so nice oh my god i cannot wait to put this on my face and it also came with 24 hour shadow in insurance i like this i use it all the time and it also came with better than sex mascara i'm not really a mascara girl but i will try this out and if i like it i'll carry on using it but if i don't i'll probably just give it to a friend or something so thank you so much for Too Faced i love you guys and i can't wait to try this out <laughs> i'm trying to like wipe off the maybelline on nudes nudes whatever you want to call it lippies and they're literally not coming off yeah, just follow you guys now. <laughs> Over here now, I'm gonna open up this little bag. It's from Buxom's again. My girl Buxom, what you got for me? So this is the new Big Tease Plumping Mascara. Okay. All right, so that is what it looks like. Ooh, look at that one. Focus. Thank you. Look at that. Oh, hey, when my camera does that. It's in French. Oh, hey, it is English. Okay. Plumping formula for full voluminous lashes. Velvety texture. Coats long lavish lashes from root to tip. Glossy black pigment. Thickens and intensify. Do you know what? Their picture looks so legit. I don't know if you guys can, like, see what I'm talking about. Like, it looks like there's no Photoshop done or anything, and I like that. I can't stand it when, like, brands, when they promote a mascara, and the model's, like, wearing, like, false eyes eyelashes like why would you do that but yeah this looks really legit i'm really happy about this okay and they also sent me a card as well size doesn't matter okay so it releases on the 29th of march on cult beauty feel unique debonyms for 18 pounds and if you live in europe it is 22 euros yeah but i literally cannot find my five guys card i'm really upset now i found it i'm so happy i'm gonna keep this right here so i don't lose that Ooh. I need to bring you closer. So this is what's in the box. Um, I'm gonna sound really bad, but I don't know who the brand is. <gasps> but let's open her up. Ooh. Oh my god, this is so cute! Oh, I get it. It's from Nug Beauty. Get it? I get. I get it. Thank you so much. So it's from Nug Beauty, and they probably contacted S. Ben, S. Ben, this brand to make me a customized bag. This is so cute. Oh, the zip. God, you know when you buy like a jacket or like a bag and the zip is just not smooth. This is so smooth. Oh, oh my god, yes! They also gave me more Nug face masks. I love Nug face masks. It's actually one of my favorite face masks that I've tried. And it's very, very, very affordable. I think my favorite face mask from um, Nug is like $3.99 or $4.99 and it's the charcoal one. That face mask is also ideal for traveling as well because it only comes in these little pouches. Over here now, open up the little bag. This is from the PR company called Doel Walker. Beauty blender, yeah. Oh, a very smushed packaging beauty blender, sorry. <laughs> this is the Be Cheeky Beauty Blender and it's not too small and it's not too big. It's like, you know, medium. This looks like a good size for me. The really, really small beauty blenders, they are like useless to 
to me because they do nothing for me. I think this is the perfect size for uh, my under eyes because I like to wear my concealer like down to here nowadays, not up to here anymore. I like to bring it all the way down here. So this will be perfect. Cool, thank you so much. Do I walk on beauty blender? Oh, my nails. <gasps> From YSL, I love YSL. These are the products that they said for me to try out. So this is, this I already have. I enjoy using this. And it also came with this, which is the Eye Perfecting Fluid. And this is the Illuminating Cleanser Water in Foam. Interesting. I'm very interested in trying this out. Universal Makeup Remover Melting Balm in Oil. Ooh. Oh. Oh. If you've ever tried YSL skincare product, it's got that iconic YSL smell. It's so like expensive and bougie, but it's not too overpowering. That's the one thing I don't like about high-end skincare products is that when they have a really strong fragrance smell, like no, do not put that in there because it will end up giving me a headache. Yeah, this one's not too bad, but I'm very excited to try this out. So this is the Yves Saint Laurent setting spray and it's hydrating as well. Okay, so what's so interesting about this setting spray, because I don't think YSL ever released a setting spray before. So if you use this, your makeup will stay on for longer, your skin is hydrated, and your skin is also radiant and glowy. Okay. It also claims that 88.7% of women said their skin felt more hydrated, 98.1% of women said their skin looked fresher, and 83% agreed that it keep makeup uniform throughout the day. All right, that's pretty good, you know. Mm. Ooh, that smells nice. Oh my god, I think I know what this is. Okay. <gasps> it says my name on this box. What the hell? YSL, you give me life. Oh, oh, it fell. For a moment, I was like, it's empty. What the hell? It fell. Okay. <laughs> Ta da! So this is the new Volupte Liquid Color Balm, which I like the sound of because I always have dry lips, like all the time. But even though I scrub my lips every day, hydrating lip balm every day, it's still really dry. I'm really excited to try this out. I'm gonna try this out tonight, actually. It smells like peaches. There's also these colors as well. I will give you guys some swatches. So this one is number 11, and this one is called Hook Me Berry, which is like a darkish berry shade. And that is the Dope Foot Applicator. Wait, hold on, is that a shape as a lip? Oh my god, it's a shape as a lip. That is so cute, I don't know if you guys can see. So can you see like the top part? That's like the Cupid's bow, that is so cute. So it's quite pigmented for a lip balm, which I like. And then I'm just gonna pick out a light shade as well. I'm gonna use this. Well, this isn't light, but you guys know what I mean. Another different shade. That's cute. Oh my god, you can see the lips better on this applicator. That is so adorable. Oh my god, yes, YSL. Come through! So these are £26, and they are available 14th of March, just for I let you guys know. Ooh! This is from L'Oreal. Little headscarf going on. Oh, it's not L'Oreal, it's Decla. Oh my god, that was so embarrassing. Do you know why I thought it was L'Oreal? It's because I saw Paris and look at that. L'Oreal would be like L'Oreal Paris. So this is like Decla Paris. Oh my god, that is so embarrassing. Please ignore me. But anyway, this is the Decla Aroma Cleanse, a makeup remover. All right. No. So it's 99% natural Decla by face, which I have no idea what that means. Seven instant benefits. Cleanses, removes makeup, even waterproof. Refreshes, softens, plumps, soothes, even sensitive skin. Boosts radiant. Skin feels 92% clean. Product removes all traces of makeup, 92%. Product effectively removes waterproof eye makeup, 89%. Product leaves the skin feeling comfortable, 86%. Skin feels softer, 90%. Skin feels more supple, 76%. Skin feels soothed, 72%. Skin looks radiant, 70%. <sighs> Interesting. So it's £28 for the 200 mils. This launches in April, by the way. Oh my god, thank you so much to Declaw for giving me the a few weeks early before it hits April. Oh! Open, please! Aha! Uh -huh. Another blender. This is from Sport Effects. I've used this already and I really like it. So thank you so much to Sport Effects for sending me another sponge. I don't know why I'm burping so much. I think it's because I'm like talking and breathing so fast. 
Ah, this is from Banish. I used to use Banish back in the day and I loved using Banish products, especially their pumpkin face mask. I wonder if there is one in here. Yes! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I've missed you so much. It's been a long time. So this is the Banish pumpkin enzyme mask. This smells amazing, by the way. Oh my god, my nails are horrible right now. Look at that. Oh my god, if you could smell this, if you love the smell of like pumpkin and like spice, Spices, that's what it smells like. It's so nice. Oh my god, I feel like I could eat it, but I'm not going to, of course, because that would be really, really dangerous. So thank you so much to Banish for sending me these products. Ooh, who are you from? Oh, it's from Mac. Oh my god, oh my god, yes! Look at these. Ah. Oh, oh, look at that pink. I need to stay away from pinks because I do too many eyeshadows with pinks in there, but this is so pretty though. Are they allowed to have a swear word on a palette? Okay. I think MAC is like the only brand that can get away with those type of things. This is like very grungy, very like Instagram baddie type of makeup colors, look thingy and bobs. I don't know what I'm saying, but you know what I'm trying to say guys. And this one is called Queen Supreme. Oh, this is all shimmers as well. This is very high fashion. I love it. That's so cool. They all cost £32 each and there are other palettes available as well. Not just these three. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine new eyeshadow palettes that MAC is releasing. So if you want to check out other shades, by all means, check out the website. I'm loving all of this though. I'm loving the theme. Yes, thank you so much to MAC for sending me these. I want to try these out. <laughs> this is from CYO. What do you have for me? Oh no, one of the blushes kind of broke. Oh no, it's an eyeshadow. It's all pink. God, I'm trying to stay away from pink eyeshadows, but it just keeps coming to me. I don't know why. So this is called Get Playful with Pink. How much pink can you handle? We've got all the shades and then some bubblegum pink, baby pink, shocking pink, millennial pink. Get playful, get creative, mix shades together, wear alone, layer up. The price range, guys, it's so cheap. <laughs> So this one is five pounds and I will do a swatch for you. Oh my God, that color though, that is beautiful. Wow, and I need to powder myself, I'm getting sweaty. And then this one, four pounds I believe. Oh, that's cute. This one is called First Light, which is that shade. And then the first one that I swatched is called Living Together. And then this one, okay. This one's like a two in two. Oh my God. Yeah. Focus. Look at that. Oh, I don't want to ruin it because it's brand new. Okay, I'm going to do a little, little swatch right here. Oh. Okay, that's what I'm doing. Okay, I powdered myself, added a bit of lip gloss. So let's move on from sleep. So I just got so much makeup from sleep. Oh my God, look at this. Um, a blusher palette and it's called Pumpkin, which I'm loving the sound of, by the way. That sounds so cute. <gasps> oh my God, look at those shades. This color, I love orange blushes, by the way. I feel like, if you're like yellow undertone, you kind of tans like me. Orange blushes just look so beautiful on our skin tone. And I'm really excited to try this out. This is so beautiful. Actually, let me do a little swatch. Oh my god, yes. Oh, that's beautiful. Very pigmented, these lashes. Sleek time to ASOS. Oh, they're available on ASOS now. Okay. Oh my god, that's so cool. Guys, if you are a uni student, ASOS always offer discount codes and everything. So if you want to try out sleek makeup, but you want to save more money, by all means, go to ASOS and check it out. Thank you so much, Sleek. I'm so excited and I'm so happy for you that you're now available available on ASOS. The next parcel is from Smashbox. Oh shoot, eyeshadows, look at that. So cute, I'm loving this. I don't have many khaki looking eyeshadows, so let me try this out. There's 16 different shades and it's available 28th of February nationwide at 20 pounds per trio. Loving the packaging, it reminds me of my Canon lens. It's even got the, um, the little gritty stuff around it as well, just like my camera lens. So they're all shimmers and that's how they swatch. Okay, this one, I didn't really put enough on my finger. Oh, look at that green one. It's so beautiful. Oh my God, I can't wait to try this out. Uh, thank you so much to Smashbox. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 
so this is the Gold Rush Blushes by Benefit. And look, they even do a mini and a full size as well. It is released in April and it's going to be £24.50. Cool. And I'm going to open the mini. I think it's so cute. Oh my god, look how tiny this is. Oh my god, it's so cute. And uh, that's what it looks like on the inside. Oh, it smells different to all the other blushes. Like, it's not sweet. It's more like, oh my god. Oh, it smells like a nice shampoo. That's the only way I can describe this smell. Like, it smells clean and fresh. <laughs> and I know there's a really bad way to describe this smell, but it just smells like a really nice shampoo. Like, something I'd wash my hair in. And now it's in the makeup product. <laughs> oh, why is my life like this? I love blushes. I just think it makes your skin look so youthful and adding a bit of pink to your cheeks or a bit of peach or a bit of like red or berry just like completes the whole look a little bit more. I mean you can't really see it because I've got loads of blusher on anyway but I can't wait to try this out. I'm gonna need to throw this out because it's just accumulating and I won't be able to get out of my rooms like by my door or the recycling so BRB. Literally struggling to get out of my room. Oh my god, my legs are dying because I went gym yesterday. Recycling is out and I can continue. Mm. You know when you're so thirsty that when you drink the water, the water goes up your nose and not in your mouth because you forgot to open your mouth? That's me! You know I was Hilla Beauty when it's DHL. I am so excited to know what's inside here. Queen! Oh my god, look at this face! Isn't she just so beautiful? Oh, talk about being divine. Look at this. So this is the Huda Beauty 3D Highlighters Palette Bronze Sands Edition. You ready guys? Oh my god. Oh my god. Queen, give me your face. This is in the shade. It just says bronze sands. Okay, so yeah, this is bronze sands. And then I think it's a little slide. Thumbnail. Oh, there's pink sands, golden sands, honey, honey, honey. So there's three new highlighter palettes that Huda Beauty released. And Huda Beauty highlighters are actually one of my favorite highlighters. And the reason why is because it's just so in your face. I don't know, I'm into highlighters that really blinds. Like right now, the highlight I'm wearing is not as blinding, but that's because I'm not wearing any foundation. I'm just wearing like quite a neutral base. But when I cake my face, I need a beaming highlights. I need something that's just as strong and pigmented just as my foundation and eyeshadows are. So that's why I love Huda Beauty highlighters because they're just so blinding. I'm gonna swatch all of them. So this is the Pink Sands one. So this is Pink Sands. Oh la la. Beautiful. And then this one is called the Bronze Sands Edition. And look at this one. Oh my god, that feels amazing. Oh, imagine this on the eyes. That'd be so beautiful. Here. Ah! Amazing. Okay, and then the next one I'm going to do on my other arm. Because this arm is pretty much done. I got really short arms, by the way. This one is called Golden Sands Edition. So soft. Oh, so this is another DHL parcel. It's from Huda, baby. Ah! Okay, so this is the Desert Dusk Sand. Okay, I am dying to try this out because this is real Arabian sand and apparently it gives you a really nice glow. So I'm really interested in how this is gonna work. This is heavy. Introducing the Huda Beauty Desert Dust Sand. The limited edition product features 100% real sand from the Arabian Desert that promises to buff away old skin and stimulate microcirculation, leaving skin noticeably smoother and brighter. Finely ground rock and mineral particles act as a natural exfoliator to reveal beautiful baby soft skin. Commenting on the creation of the Huda Beauty Desert Sand. P.S. This is an April Fool's prank, but we appreciate you playing along with us until we reveal the secret on April 1st. Oh! What? I'm so confused. Wait, so I can't use this then? Oh my god! <laughs> All my friends who use this product on Instagram, this is not meant to be used on the body. Huda! That's dangerous! 
because, you know, I read things, but I don't think my friend read things. Oh my God, I need to call up my friends. Okay, another one. Wow, this is like, this just took my breath away instantly. <gasps> oh, okay. Oh my god, let me show you a comparison of other House of Lashes. So this is Demoir Light, and can you see like the differences? Like these are way more dramatic and more fluffy, and then these are like, you know, simple but still beautiful and glamorous. Oh my god, so beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Cannot wait to try these. I am a eyelash whore. I love eyelashes. Elements! Ele 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 elements! Thank you so much to Elements. I cannot wait to try these out. I love Elements products and I love their facial spa as well. It's so amazing. I did a vlog on it. So if you want to check it out, link will be in the description box. <laughs> Make a revolution, it just like splattered all over my lap. <laughs> okay, this colour though, look at that, it's like snow. That is beautiful and the packaging is gorgeous as well. I'm loving it. There's so many shades. I'm definitely gonna put some in a giveaway and give some to my friends. Is Mac Times Nico Panda. Oh my god, this is so cute! Look at that! Ah! This is up my street. Oh my god. Okay, let me just take everything out so I can show you guys. These are adorable. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes. This, this eyeshadow palette is what I need. I need to step out of my comfort zone and do a crazy colorful makeup look. Open. I don't want to rip you. Come on. <gasps> wow. Oh my god. That is gorgeous. I need to swatch the purple one. Wow. Look at that. This is called About Turn. So this is like a autumn. Autumn. <laughs> autumn. I was going to say autumnal, but then I stopped myself from saying that word to say Autumn. I don't know, man. I'm just weird. Anyway, it reminds me of autumn. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, okay, guys, I'm done. I'm done. If you saw the mess, literally, this is what I'm living in right now. Okay, so that is the end of the PR unboxing video. Thank you so much for watching and seeing me sweat. <laughs> I started filming this, well I started really late, I started at 8pm and now it's currently midnight so I've been doing this for 4 hours. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you enjoy these really nice long PR unboxing videos. I wanted to make sure that I added in a bit more detail compared to my first PR unboxing vi video. A lot of people were like, could you like do more swatches? And I was like, okay, definitely. So this one I added in a little bit more detail so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give this video a thumbs up if I can get this video. I don't know. 800 thumbs up that would mean the world to me and I would do another one as well I love doing these type of videos and I do them for you as well I love you guys so much Bye.